Hi guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. Today I am going to be doing my first trimester update, bump date, go over all of that. So this might be a long video, I'm sorry if it is. I will try to keep it short and concise, but I am currently, <sighs> tomorrow I will be 14 weeks. So I will be completely out of my first trimester and this is the only time I have to film this video. So we're doing it one day early, but we are doing it. So I have my bump date questions right here. And then as I go, I'm sure I will blab or talk about something else. I also have Duke right here. Oakland is napping and Riley's almost done with work. So we're kind of on a time crunch. <laughs> um, first of all, how far along are you? These are gonna be the same questions throughout my whole pregnancy. So I am 13 weeks and six days um right now but uh from i found out at three weeks and like four days or three weeks and five days i was nine dpo i got like a shadow of a line 10 dpo i got a faint line and 11 dpo i got a very positive line and a positive digital so i was very very early i was before four weeks we've literally known for so long and it's been such a hard pregnancy it's, it's been like the longest time of my life oh it's been rough size of the baby so let's see um i have two apps so currently the baby is the size of a lemon that doesn't make any sense three inches and one ounce i feel like lemons are huge and my ovia app says that the baby is the size of a macaroon. So that's fun. It started out as a poppy seed and now we're the size of a macaroon. That's, <laughs> we've grown quite a bit. Uh, baby size and weight, like I just said, about three inches, maybe an ounce. Um, my total weight gain, I have not gained any weight. I've actually lost weight. I've been so sick, I don't throw up. Thank goodness. Um, I never threw up with Oakland either, but I was also only sick for like two weeks. And this has been like 11 weeks of just, I feel horrible all day, every day. So I just don't really eat a whole ton, but I haven't gained any weight and I've actually lost like five pounds. I've gained some of it back, but I'm still like in the negative of I haven't gained any weight. Baby's development. Gosh, that's kind of a hard one. Um... <laughs> Um, over the whole first trimester, so much happens. They go from a little tiny like poppy seed, just like blastosis, to like a full formed baby now. Like there's little arms and legs and the fingers. The eyes are formed and now there's eyelids. Um, there's like, the ears are almost in position. Um, um, stretch marks. I don't have any new stretch marks. I got stretch marks at the end with Oakland with my first pregnancy, so. I still have those, but no new stretch marks. Maternity clothes. I need to be in maternity clothes, and I needed to be in maternity clothes from like week six. I've been so bloated. My stomach has been so like soft and squishy, so it hurts. I'm carrying a lot higher this time. Right? No, I'm carrying lower this time, which is like, I mean, it's bloat, so I'm not carrying anything. Um, but like things can't be at the bottom of my stomach. So like any of my like pants or sweatpants that I have, they're like a little bigger, are so uncomfortable because they hit underneath my belly. Ugh, it kills, it's so uncomfortable. So I need to get maternity clothes. I have like my Lululemon leggings that go up, um, but I should probably get a bigger size because <sighs> all my maternity clothes from before do not fit anymore. I'm not that size and they are not gonna fit. Gender, we do know we got a blood test done, um, but I've said in previous vlogs, I personally like to have an ultrasound where I can see it and confirm it. Um, I've never had a blood test done besides this time, last time with Oakland, we found out with an ultrasound and just personally I like to confirm it before we announce. So we know, but we need to confirm. Movement, none. I'm still too early, I do have an anterior placenta this time. So the first time I had a Oops, is awake. Did you watch your show? Come here, Angel. Good morning. How's your nap? 
AirPods. Oh yeah, they were in the middle. They were in the crevice of the couch. I found them last night, and they still have a charge. Yeah, I know. Okay, we had a little Munchkin join. She woke up early from her nap, which is honestly ideal. That's so bad, so much better than me waking her up. But I know a little bit sad. That's okay. Movement. Um, I haven't really felt anything. I'm still a little early. But I do have an anterior placenta this time and I had a posterior before so like with Oakland I didn't feel I felt stuff but not a bunch and like I never felt contractions with her or anything like I really didn't feel a whole lot This time though, I swear I felt like flutters or what I think are kicks at like 11 weeks and I asked my doctor and he said maybe but more than likely probably not like you're just remembering what they feel like maybe gas bubbles um so i don't know but i feel like i felt stuff but i'm sure i will feel a whole lot more because now my placenta is like facing my back versus in front of my like uterus and tummy so that's kind of interesting and i'm excited to see if i feel a ton more um sleep for the first part of the trimester, first trimester, I slept horribly. Like I was so tired all the time, I couldn't sleep, I had insomnia. If I woke up, which I always do, because I go, I wake up early with her at like three or four, I either go lay in her room with her to help her fall back asleep, or I like go back to my room, or I'm just up in the middle of the night making sure she's okay, and then I'd be awake for the rest of the night. So that was hard, it's gotten better. Um, but it's still just not great. I don't sleep a whole ton. But I actually started taking naps early on in the first trimester, which is not like me, I hate naps. So I was very tired. Um, what I miss, I don't miss anything other than just like not feeling like garbage all day, every day. That just sucks. That's the only thing I miss. I just wanna not feel horrible <laughs> and then I'll be fine. Um, well, symptoms. I don't like it. Let me change it. <laughs> Which one? Hmm. Baby shark laughing? Mm -hmm. That one with the sharks? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, symptoms, gosh, I had everything the first trimester. I was tired, my boobs were really sore and huge. I felt sick all the time. We didn't like, like I said, I found out really early so I didn't have a whole ton of like, symptoms that made me think I was like I found out as soon as I could and then the symptoms hit like a week later and I had everything like textbook everything my gums hurt my breasts were sore my I was nauseous I was so tired I was so thirsty everything I had everything and the last one which is a new one for me is sibling is she doesn't really know what's going on um we've talked about it a ton i think she knows every once in a while she'll like want to hug my belly or kiss it or snuggle it and we'll say like oh you know baby's in there baby brother or baby sister's in there and she's like uh no i don't i don't like it um she loves kids and she loves babies and she loves playing so i think once the baby's here she'll be excited but i just don't think she gets it right now and she's like i'm i'm the baby and i'm not in your belly so what are you talking about oh <sighs> Yeah, that's my bump date. I don't have any other questions. I do, I read some questions. Some people asked how long it took us to TTC this time. Um, and with Oakland, it took us like seven months, seven or eight months. And this time actually I got my IUD out in August and had a period. And then I found out I was pregnant in September. So one month, I guess, which we feel very fortunate and lucky. We, I know that that's not the case for everybody. Um, and it wasn't the case for us the first time. So I'm really grateful and we're really excited. This baby is due early June, which will be so fun. And then she's kind of like early, mid August, which is so fun. I love summer birthdays and parties and stuff. It's just gonna be so fun. So if you guys have any other questions or anything you want me to add to my bump date list, Leave them in the comments below so I can add them. Or if you have just any other like general questions, let me know. This pregnancy has been so different from with Oakland and like complete polar opposites. I feel like I was only sick with her. I was watching old videos. I was only sick with her for like two weeks. And other than that, like I was fine. 
I, my hair was growing, my skin was glowing, my, I didn't get stretch marks till like the very end, like everything was so easy and went so well and this one has been so hard and I feel like I'm not gaining weight but my body is much bigger. That's, I think it's because I'm losing weight from like just, I don't feel good so I don't eat a whole lot but like my body is so much bigger, my stomach is huge already. I'll show you guys at the end but it's huge <laughs> like I don't I don't know it's just so different this time and it might be harder because I have a toddler so it just you know it's a lot harder but we're so excited we I can't believe it's happening I don't know if I want to do from here on out because the first trimester I feel like everything's like all kind of the same it all sucks it just doesn't change so starting 14 weeks and maybe on i don't know if i want to do like every two weeks or every four weeks um like once a month i'm not sure what i'll do quite yet but i do want to do more of these because i loved watching them with oakland and kind of being able to compare this time so i'd love to know this time for the next time even though like it's harder to film and it's harder to feel good and stuff i just i do want to know so if you have any other Mommy. hi i oh, love you so even though it's harder, let me know if you guys have any questions and I will add them or if you have any other questions for my first trimester or just like in general, leave them below because I would love to answer them, chat with you in the comments or answer them in my next video. Here is 13 weeks. I feel like it's so like chunky, right? I mean, not bad, but very bloated. Thank you so much for watching. Thanks for supporting. I love you guys, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. What a wonderful